Yeah, Nick, how is Germany able to influence the decisions that Brussels makes about these tariffs? Well, it's not supposed to be able to, and certainly trade dealings for the European Union are dealt with by Brussels, by a trade commissioner, and he's supposed to be autonomous, sovereign, if you will. But, of course, there's all kinds of pressure that can take place, horse trading and so on. Uh, certainly, uh, there's pressure from China, which is saying that, well, if there are tariffs against solar panels, they might slap tariffs on French wine. So that's a way of bringing the French around to their point of view, which is less amicable uh, than the way they're using it with the Germans. But I think... First and foremost, people in Brussels are thinking about what would happen if a trade war started uh, with the Chinese economy beginning to slow down, still growing at rates that everybody in Europe uh, feels jealous towards. And uh, Europe and the economic doldrums, this is simply not the time to start any kind of tit-for-tat tariff imposition. Uh, and I think that might be what brings around uh, the commissioner in Brussels. Certainly Germany is uh, making the case uh, and has been making it for a few weeks now. We know, of course, the Germany sells so many goods to China, but what exactly is China getting out of this relationship? Well, China is exporting a lot to, to Germany as well. But what they're doing is insisting that German companies that get market access also invest in Chinese company, companies, uh, set up uh, their own manufacturing plants in China, for instance, and bring in that German know-how, because that's what the Chinese are after to, to a large extent. So they will be able uh, to produce the same kinds of machine-tooled goods, the same kind of drive shafts for uh, big heavy equipment, for instance, on construction sites that the Germans are specialized at, that are w world beaters at. And so in a decade's time, uh, they'll be going up the value chain, and they might be uh, competing with the Germans uh, on, on the, in, the, in, their, in their own uh, domain of predilection, which is to say high-end uh, machine goods. So that's what the Chinese are looking for in exchange, market access for know-how. Nick Spicer in Berlin. Many thanks.